This video will be interfacing DST11 humidity and temperature sensor with STM32 microcontroller and display humidity and temperature on 16 to LCD display. So here is a circuit diagram. So we have connected B11, B10, A4, A3, A2 and A1 of STM32 to 16 to LCD display and DST11 output pin is connected to A0. So this is the circuit we have assembled as shown in the figure. So we have STM32 microcontroller so you can see B11 and B10 is connected similarly A5 to A0 is connected so this is 16 to LCD display and we have also used a 10k potentiometer to adjust the contrast so you can see this is a DST11 humidity and temperature sensor it is supplied with 5 volt BCC as well as ground and we have connected data pin to PA0 so now will be just uploading the code so once the code is uploaded so you can use any of the method there are five or six method to upload the code so i am using uploading code using bootloader so once the code is uploaded it will start displaying the temperature and humidity value temperature is displayed on degree celsius and humidity is displayed on percentage so currently you can see there is no change in humidity and temperature but now i have wet my hand now I will place my weight hand at the sensing portion of DST11 so you can see there is increase in humidity as the surface has become wet so even the temperature value will change as soon as it discovers the low temperature so you can see 32.70 it has decreased so here is a code the code is very simple so we have used LCQ crystal library so you can see PB11, PB10 PA4, PA3, PA2 and PA1 are assigned as RSEN to digital pins. So DST.h is a library. I have given the link in the description. You can just download that library. And we have assigned DST pin to PA0 of STM32. So this is just serial begin or LCD begin for displaying DST11. And we are using float S and float T command to display the humidity and temperature value. So once it is done, so select the board. We are using STM32 F103C series board and 128 kilobyte flash variant. Upload method is STM32 Duno bootloader. You can upload by directly via USB port. So after selecting all these options, just click on compile. Once the compiling is done, you can simply upload the code. Thank you for watching.